What is going on, guys? Now, you guys have known me to do vocal cover shows for many years now. And as of tomorrow, tomorrow will be one of my last shows that I do because I will be moving on to doing other content not related to this. So, if you guys have been kicking it this whole time, I want to say thank y'all, man. And to start this off right, to start off one of the very last shows for you guys, we're going to do it like this. Now anybody wants to sit there and talk shit, it's going to go bye-bye. Oh, and before I start this next song real quick, I do want to say this. For those that think that I'm quitting YouTube, I'm not. I'm just changing up content. Coming Friday, boy. Cause your boy's getting a massive motherfucking upgrade. So your boy will be doing different stuff other than this. And I ain't saying what it is. You guys are going to have to find out on Friday, man. So with that being said... Let's get this party going. You know, it's funny. A lot of people like to talk shit about me. And they don't even know why they hate on me. They really don't know why they hate on me. Which I find very funny. A lot of people tend to hate for no reason. And they don't even know why they hate. They're just hating because everybody else hates. Which is honestly sad. But also funny. Because it brings in free views. You know, I find the troll community very interesting. I really do. I find the troll community very, very interesting. And you want to know why that is? I find it very interesting because a lot of the trolls, they don't know why they hate. They don't know why they hate me. They just hate me to hate me. And I find that very interesting because they're just doing what everybody else is doing. Hating for no reason. And I find that very interesting because, see, while they sit there and hate, I do my job. While they sit there and hate, I do my job. And I find that funny. And Sleazy, so even you don't know why you hate. You say you do, but deep down, you truly, truly don't know why you hate. You just hate because everybody else does, and honestly, I hope you heal from that. I do. I hope that you heal up from that, and you start to do better for yourself. There's that moment in work when there's too many tools and the spark fades. And you know, before I start this next one, man, 
I just want to say that I am for every single one of you guys that hates. For every one of you guys that hates on me, I want you guys to know that I'm praying for you guys. And I hope that you guys are able to find out within yourselves to forgive yourselves as to why you hate me. I hope that you guys do find the strength to stop hating yourselves because when you hate on me, you hate yourself. And that's a fact. When you hate me, you hate yourself. You're projecting how you feel about yourself about me. And honestly, I'm sorry that you hate yourselves. I'm sorry about what you're going through. Whatever it is, I'm sorry. And just know that I'm here for you. I care about y'all. I'm your guys' friend. I'm the guy that y'all can lean on, motherfuckers. Sorry about that, y'all. I didn't take care of something. But to everybody that's in chat right now, for all y'all that have wronged me, for all y'all that have hated on me, bashed on me, attacked me, done whatever, I want you guys to know that I forgive you guys. Because you guys don't know what it's like to be loved. You guys have never had that love in your life, and I, I forgive you for that. And I apologize that you guys have never had that. And even though you don't deserve it, I even forgive you, Marty. And you, William. And you, Edward, boy. I forgive you. Because let me tell you something. Over these last few days of being in therapy, I learned a lot about forgiveness. I learned a lot about myself. And let me tell you, I don't hate you guys. I don't hate any of you. I hate what you guys have done. But even though I hate what you guys have done, I still forgive you. Even though you guys might not be able to forgive yourselves and forgive me for my wrongdoings, just know that I forgive all of you. I forgive every single one of you. And I'm sorry that you're having trouble forgiving me and forgiving yourselves. But just know that I forgive you. And that I feel bad that you can't forgive yourselves. But hopefully one day, you'll be able to do like I did and escape all that and be able to forgive yourselves for what's going on. And just know that I do pray for you guys every single night. Struggling with moderate to severe Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis? Talk to your doctor about number one prescribed and tip. Now, I'm sure you guys are wondering. Why would you forgive us for everything that we've done and how we attack you? Well, the answer to that is very simple, my friends. It's because like me, you guys are human. 
Just like myself, you guys are human. You guys are humans, just like myself. I make mistakes, you guys make mistakes. I fuck up, you guys fuck up. We all fuck up all the time, that's what we do as humans. And even though you guys are still spewing hateful comments, I forgive your hatred. I forgive your hateful comments. I don't hate them, I don't hate you. It's just you guys projecting. And like I said, I'm sorry that your guys' lives are like that. But one thing I learned in therapy over the last few days is this. If you want to like, and you want to change your life, you have to be willing to put forth the effort to change it. It's not you can't change by itself. You have to change your life. You have to step up and you have to be willing to put in that work. Me, I'm here and I'm ready to put in that work to change my life for the better. And I've been changing my life for the better over the last couple of days. And I can honestly say thank you to those that were in the therapy session that did help me out. To everybody that was in those sessions, I appreciate you guys. If you guys ever see this, just know that I'm very grateful to you guys for putting me back on the right path. Because I had lost my way. I was lost. I was scared, even though I was afraid to admit it. I had lost who I was. But because of you guys that were in therapy with me, I was able to find myself again and get back on the right track. And I can't thank you guys enough for that. And for you guys that are still trapped in that darkness of self love. <laughs> And you know, for every single one of you guys that does hate me, I do genuinely feel bad for you. I feel bad that you guys feel like you have to hate. You don't have to hate. See, you were not born with hatred. Hatred is taught over time. And I have very, one very simple question for everybody in chat. Who is it? Who is it that hurt you? Who is it that made you feel so bad that you feel like you have to hate? But more importantly, I ask you this. Who taught you how to hate? Now for those of you that are still lost, for those of you that are still lost in your own hatred towards me, I want you guys to take a second to stop and breathe. And bow your head in silence.
was his next prayer. Triple A Auto. And with that, my friends, I bid you guys farewell. And I hope that you guys have a good rest of your day, evening, or afternoon, wherever you guys are in the world. And just know, just know that I forgive you. And I no longer hate any of you. So with that, my friends, I will see you guys back here tomorrow for the final show. Hello, guys. Have a good day. Peace. Oh, and uh, may God be with you.